always have to carry a certain amount of batteries when they go on a 96-hour patrol, and they carry those batteries because they have to communicate. Well, if we can provide them with the capability to not have to carry so many batteries, then that means that they can stay out longer. They can do more patrols, and they won't need to worry about being resupplied. They can sustain them on their own for a longer period of time. XFOB is, um, I like to call it a shortcut. Um, what it does is it allows us to use commercially available technologies to shorten the pathway from uh, technology development to implementation in the Marine Corps. The leg braces that help store energy as you walk, um, there's small kinks that you gotta work out there, like how they strap on a leg creates hot spots, but it's a phenomenal idea, and I think if the Marine Corps had that three years ago, the way that it helps assist uh, slow down your leg movement, it wouldn't have so much shock force on your legs. My knees would be fine. We bring a team of engineers, and they actually wire up each of the systems, um, and they're gonna collect data on them throughout the week. All that data gets wrapped up into a report, and then we'll make a decision to purchase, um, in limited quantities, maybe one or two of these systems. Nothing that's here is gonna be something that the Marine Corps will buy today. But the idea is to, to see the possibility. That's what we're looking for.